G'day guys, Smith City here for Smith City Product Reviews. Well, after the last video of sheer disappointment, I'm back. Reval Brewing Company IPA coming in at 7.5% ABV. ABV, there's the can, that's what it looks like in the can. We'll open it up for you guys. Mowed the lawns before, sun's out. Looking forward to this. Here we go. So I do believe this is a West Coast style IPA, which generally I like them a little bit more than East Coast IPAs. But I think that's because I've had a lot more West Coast IPAs than East Coast IPAs. But heavily carbonated. Tiny head. One finger. Does look like a thick, thicker type uh, head there. So I don't know how long it'll stick around for. But yeah, as you can see there, carbonation bubbles are going absolutely ballistic there. From all the way from the bottom. Pretty much the entire length of liquid up to the head. Get the aroma. It smells bit bittery, like bitterness. Smelling some lime and some lemon. Some orange. Just some trop just your standard tropical type uh, flavours so a bit hesitant after the last beer I tried but um, yeah we'll see how this one goes cheers that's more like it There's some um, there's some complexity to that. It does have a really nice sweetness on the on the back palate. And um, yeah, it is quite bitter. It's... Just had a delivery at the door. I think it's my birthday present. So yeah, there's there's quite a nice level of bitterness on the back palate but there's also some sweetness going on um, I wouldn't say it's got a thin mouth feel it's not like a, a thick coating it's more of sort of um, so, sort of somewhere in between being thin and being um, creamy. That's what it looks like. So, might as well read off the can quickly. Australian owned and independent Reval Brewing Company is located in the vibrant heart of Oxford Street, Bulimba. We revel in creating handcrafted local brewed beers that are bursting with personality and flavour. One sip of our West Coast style IPA and you'll think you're enjoying a tropical fruit drink with a punch. Simple malt bill takes a back seat to let the hop shine. A generous helping of mosaic, citra and Simcoe combine to provide the big hop flavour punch associated with this style. It's 2.2 standard drinks. Made in Australia, Bulimba, Queensland, River Brewing, co.com.au uh, proudly centered in an aerial outline of our riverside home and Bulimba the revel spark represents our passion for fresh local independent craft beer let's go packaging I think the packaging is pretty good 
Um, there's a lot of information on it, which is quite handy. Uh, sometimes I like that, sometimes I don't, depending on what, what's happening with the beer in hand. Sometimes I don't feel like it needs it. Um, yeah, I don't mind their logo. Um, good people drink good beer. Hashtag reveling. There's a certified independent logo. Um, style Indian Pale Ale. Malt Pale in Munich. I've told you the hops. The yeast is US Ale. Appearance golden with a very light haze and creamy white, uh, uh, white head. Fruity, tropical fruit and citrus dominant up front with a slight piney resinous character. Yeah, so the back end you are getting a bitter resin type um, piney element coming through. 7.5% ABV. Yeah, if you want to check out their website, please do. So, price, um, this was in a package, so I'll put the cost in the description. Drinkability, um, for something at 7.5, that's scarily, that's, that's dangerous, uh, dangerous drinkability, because that, that this is really easy to drink, but it's such a high alcohol content. The fact that it is easy drinking, you can polish a few of these off, and that that'd be our game over. Insert coins. So, drinkability is good. Talked about packaging. Talked about the company a little bit. Go for a rating. Um, I'm just going to give this a solid eight. Good stuff. Really, really good stuff by Revel Brewing Company. That's it for me. Cheers.